It's quiet. Still, make sure to stay cautious. It's where the Alpha and AT buy is. Now, get ready. I'll be supporting with the drone. So this must be eight or seven. Yes. This was the final battlefield of civilization. It was also known as a truly colossal city. Something is falling from the sky. A strange sensation. This must be Earth's rain. We can admire the scenery later. We have a job to do here. The terrain data has changed recently. Falling debris. Be careful, Lee. Something is coming. It's a crustacean type enemy. They're common around here. <laughs> All right, the area is clear. Buildings are collapsing. It's because of the city's unstable terrain. You'll get used to it soon. What's wrong? Uh, it's nothing. From here on, you have to stay alert, Eve. Fusion cell. Let's open the car's hood. Ah, surprise! At least the fusion cell. Fusion cell? It's a high energy compression battery. Thanks to that, Earth's night isn't dark yet. Oh, it's the previous generation of the infinity cell. Be sure to keep that, it's very valuable.
we're in the clear. Where do we go now? This way. There are traces of mark. You have to cross here. Do you see the ladder behind me? I can't reach the ladder. The water level is too low. Try using the plank. We have to go through this building. Try putting the fusion cell you have here. Adam, what is this? Don't you know this already? It's a map. A map? How do you synchronize the location on the map? <sighs> oh, looks like this used to be a library. Are these boxes displayed on the wall storage devices? Sort of. They can only store up to one megabyte of data. What a waste of resources. The crack is quite deep. It's going to be difficult to pass. We'll have to go across, past the parking tower. May your memories live on forever. A supply camp in a place like this. Supply camp? What's that? It's a depot set up by the airborne squad who came here before. Looks like it's been abandoned for a long time. How come they set up a camp in a corner like this? Well, the supply camp also serves as an important base. Is this parking lot important? It could also mean that this place is very dangerous. Then I guess this place could be useful for us. Adam? Yeah? About yesterday. 
Thank you for saving me. It's nothing, really. Though I have used up almost all of the exospine materials that I collected over the years. Oh. It's all right. That now means we can help each other. We can track down the Alpha Nativa together. And, well, I'd have trouble making it out here by myself anyway. If you can locate the Hall of Records, you'll have done more than enough. Listen, don't worry. I promise, I'll make sure to repay you. Defeated it, Eve. Amazing. It wasn't an Alpha Nativa. It wasn't, but still so strong. Things will only get harder. Maybe. Anyway, please show me the next route, Adam. Right, hold on. Let me take a look at the map data. As the crow flies, the Hall of Records isn't too far from here. But an entire block is submerged. We have to find a way to cross. Are you saying that there's no way? I found it. Do you see the sign behind the stone statue? There's a transportation device there that you can use. What? You really think that these abandoned devices are still going to work? Well, the supply camp was in one piece. Let's just try to stay positive. 
Uh huh. Positive. Sure. May your memories live on forever. You need to go there to get to the transportation device.
Adam. I was very surprised when I first met you. Why? Back in the colony, we learned that everyone on Earth was completely wiped out. I'm sure it must have seemed that way. But you can't expect Mother Sphere to know everything. Then there are other survivors out there, like you. Mm. Yes, but it's rare to see them. Earth is still pretty inhospitable to humans. We're here. Where's the transportation device? Try activating this monorail panel. There is no power. No worries. Let's check the power control room under the stairs. Reorganize the code in order to restore power. That's great. Try activating the monorail panel again. Something is heading our way. Don't worry. It's the monorail. This ancient electronic device is our transport. All right then. After you. remembering something from yesterday. This city, it's so quiet, and so lonesome. Well, that's what happens when a city becomes devoid of the air. Eve, what are you going to do after you defeat the Alpha Nitiba? All airborne squad members exist for one sole purpose. All we must do is complete the mission. You mean, the extinction of all Natibas? Right? To think that the point of your existence is to snuff out another species. <laughs> no fun in that. Looks like this used to be a plaza. You're right. Except it's underwater now. The good thing is you won't have to go in the water. The Hall of Records is that way. Everything. 
Everything looks like an apocalypse. What? Nothing. Just talking to myself. It's a victory monument. The Hall of Records is under there. Great. Power has been restored. Find a Legion soldier with access codes. I scanned the credentials. We'll head down to the Hall of Records now. I can't believe we're in the Hall of Records. It's like a dream. Now, all we have to do is find the hyperdrive. At the start of the 22nd century, humanity's right to life was threatened by advanced global warming. Having foreseen this, Mother Sphere ensured mankind could meet this challenge. The eons-long process of natural adaptation resolved near instantly. The body cell replaced the heart and made it possible to survive in environments without oxygen or water. Thanks to advances in biotechnology and nanotechnology, the inconveniences of aging and disease were a thing of the past. This created giant leaps forward in the development of hazardous industrial spaces and space itself. We can now withstand the crushing pressures of the deepest oceans and even exit a space station without the need of a spacesuit. Humanity's greatest and only hope for survival can be found in Mother Sphere. Please, enjoy the harmony and prosperity of ADOS 7, the first city ever built by Mother Sphere, the mother of... I have no idea what that was all about. Adam, did it make any sense to you? Mankind's past was buried with the final war. This must be a video from before that time. Hypercell. Is this what you're looking for? Yes. You can extract it from the hyperdrive. Great. 
We accomplished our first objective. Let's go before the emergency power runs out. Cell. This is going to do a lot of good. Eve, thank you. Um, okay. Then, can you tell me where the Alpha Nativa is? <laughs> of course. It isn't far. Should we head down again? No, just follow the path and go straight. We've come quite far. How much more do we have to go? We just have to pass that sewage facility. There must be a way to get across. Build ourselves a bridge if we use that crane. What is this? It doesn't seem useful, but it looks intriguing. I'll look into it later.
Adam, I have a question. What is it? The hypercell. If it sustained the Hall of Records until now, it must be a huge source of energy. Yes. Even compared to a fusion cell. Then, where are you planning to use this energy? Oh, well, it's kind of a long story. But I can explain more when you come back. Understood. Loud and clear. Try using the crane. It's not working. Hmm. But there is power. That's strange. Oh, we need an ID card if we want to operate it. Three of them, actually. If the ID cards are needed for the crane, then they should be nearby. I'll look for the closest one first. Okay, you can take your time. Before the war. Hmm. What do you think it looked like? Well, probably upright buildings, well manicured flora, and living people. That's it? You have no imagination. Then again, I guess you've never been here before. Imagine bustling streets, crystal clean air, and people smiling everywhere you look. Have you ever seen something like that before, Adam? Yes. A long time ago. Eve, are you ready to leave? I just wanted to imagine what you were telling me. <laughs> it's hard to imagine. Let's go. <sighs> We're finally outside. See that crater over there? That area is Alpha Nativa territory. What's a drop pod doing there? It was abandoned a long time ago. Matter of fact, it's what made this crater. Wait, that's a 5th Airborne Squad drop pod. Let's take a closer look. Pretty faint, but I'm picking up a distress signal coming from that drop pod. That means... There might still be survivors. Really? I can't say for sure, and the Alpha Nativa could appear at any moment. So let's make sure we're well prepared. What's here? Wait, I hear something. Eve, look up.
my goodness. I can't believe this. This is the Alpha Nateba. You can tell by looking at its core. An Alpha core? If she were... Eve. Hmm? Uh, there's something you need to know. The truth is... Hello? Here! Can somebody rescue me? Please? Are you in voice? In the pod. If you're there, please help. What the...? Uh. A survivor from the airborne squad. Oh. Were you the one who sent the rescue signal? Huh? Oh, yes. Yes, it was me. You're a member of the 7th Airborne Squad, right? Yes. And you? Right. Let me introduce myself. I'm an engineering support of the 5th Airborne Squad. Lily Artemis II. But you can just call me Lily. <laughs> so just to recap, you were in that hideout waiting for another squad to arrive for almost two years? And then you met us. Yes. Thank you so much for saving me. I've been waiting a long time for the next squad to come in. It's been really lonely here. It's really lucky we were able to find you when we did. Eve, you're from the Airborne Squad Assault Force, right? Yes. Then I can be your engineering support. Of course, I will need proper equipment first. Equipment? Hmm. Well... I did want to say something earlier. What is it? Actually, there's a city where other survivors, besides me, live. What? Really? It's called Zion, humanity's last city. If we go there, there might be people that can help us. I have a safe house with some equipment I bet you would want. Then let's head there quickly! Before that, I would like to ask you something. Currently, Zion is holding out under the guidance of Oracle, who is also our spiritual leader. It's complicated. Eve, I imagine completing your mission isn't any easier having lost your comrades. So, please, help me save Zion. If you do, I promise Oracle and I will do everything we can to help you on your mission. It's about joining forces and helping each other, just like we did before. Sound good? Yes. Thanks to teamwork, I was able to get the Alpha Call. Maybe we can get more information in the city, Eve. Think about it. Yes. I suppose there's no reason to say no. However, I want to decide after hearing the story from that person you're calling Orkel. That shouldn't be a problem. Okay. I can definitely get behind that idea. Well, I guess that settles that. All right, then. Let's head to Zion. Yes! 